Your vehicle is equipped with either 8-way or 20-way power front seats. 8-way controls are located on the outboard sides of each seat, while 20-way controls are located on the front door panels near the handle. The seat switch moves the seat forward, rearward, up, or down. To tilt the front of the seat cushion up or down, pull or push the front of the seat switch in the desired direction. The angle of the seat back can be adjusted with the seat back recline switch. On Grand Wagoneer models, you can adjust the upper seat back angle independently and extend or retract the front of the seat cushion for better thigh support. The plus and minus buttons adjust the lumbar in, out, or lumbar up, down, as well as the back and thigh bolsters. Choose the item you want to adjust in the front comfort and convenience display or the Uconnect display. Wagoneer models have a power lumbar switch next to the other seat controls. You can increase or decrease lumbar support and move it up or down. The front passenger seat may offer power or manual adjustment. For manual controls, move the seat forward or rearward by pulling up on the bar under the seat. Pull up on the seat back lever to adjust the angle of the seat back. Manual front seat four-way head restraints can be raised by simply pulling up on the headrest or lowered by pushing the adjustment button on the side of the headrest and then pushing down on the headrest. To adjust the headrest forward or rearward, push the adjustment button, then move the top of the headrest toward the front or rear of the vehicle as desired and release. The Grand Wagoneer's power front head restraints can be moved up, down, forward, or rearward with a switch on the door trim panel. Outboard second and third row head restraints are not adjustable, but will automatically fold forward when the seats are folded flat. The driver's and front passenger seat backs may be equipped with the available power massage feature, which can be turned on or off with the massage button located on the door panel, or through the comfort screen on the radio. The engine must be running to use this feature. Once activated, the massage controls will display on the front comfort and convenience display or the Uconnect display. Here you can choose different massage types and intensity levels. The front heated and ventilated seats, if equipped, can be controlled with the buttons on each side of the radio or through the touchscreen. Pushing the heated seat button multiple times will switch from high to medium, low, and off. Pushing the ventilated seat button works the same way. If the two second row outboard seats are heated and ventilated, they can be operated independently with switches on the rear of the center console or from the rear comfort and convenience display if equipped. The engine must be running to operate heated and ventilated seats. Keep in mind, Power driver's and passenger's seat positions, along with side mirror positions, radio presets, and more, can be saved to a memory profile. To save a profile, place the ignition in the on-run position, but do not start the vehicle. On Wagoneer models, push the S button on the driver's or passenger's door, then push one of the memory buttons within five seconds. On Grand Wagoneer models, Push one of the memory buttons for at least two seconds and look for confirmation in the instrument cluster display. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.